Have you ever wondered how Hopfield networks work in machine learning? They are a fascinating concept that can be quite complex to grasp, but today, we'll delve into the basics, making it accessible and easy to understand. Imagine a city where all roads lead to Rome, and no matter which direction you take, you'll always end up in the same place. That's a bit like how a hop field network functions. It's a type of recurrent artificial neural network, which means it operates in a cycle, constantly feeding information back into itself. Named after the brilliant scientist John Hopfield, who introduced it back in the early 80s, a hop field network is designed to store patterns. The network can be fed a partial pattern, and it will attempt to complete it based on the patterns it has stored. This is a process known as associative memory, and it's a key feature of Hopfield networks. Now you might ask, how does this network store and recognize patterns? Well, it's all about the weights. In a Hopfield network, neurons are connected to each other through these weights. When the network is trained, these weights are adjusted in such a way that the system can recall the correct patterns. A change in one neuron state will affect the other neurons to which it's connected, causing the network to evolve until it reaches a stable state, which is the remembered pattern. But what happens when the network encounters a new or incomplete pattern? This is where the magic happens. The network will try to match it to the closest stored pattern, completing it in the process. This ability to fill in the blanks makes Hopfield networks incredibly useful in a variety of applications, from image recognition to data compression. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Hopfield networks have their limitations. For instance, they can only store about 20% of the number of their neurons as distinct patterns. And while they are good at recognizing patterns, they can sometimes confuse similar ones, leading to errors. To wrap up, Hopfield networks are fascinating tools in the field of machine learning. They store and recognize patterns, complete partial patterns, and are used in numerous applications. However, they also have their limitations and are not foolproof. They are a testament to the ever-evolving world of artificial intelligence, reminding us that even within the realm of machine learning, there's always room for improvement and innovation.